Alright, in this video, I'm going to be comparing Wi-Fi versus Ethernet. So starting off this comparison, there are pros and cons to each. The main advantage to Wi-Fi is that it allows you to have internet access throughout your entire house. You could be sitting on your couch, lying in bed, relaxing on your other couch, sitting outside, or chilling in your man cave and still be able to browse the web. However, the Wi-Fi speeds are generally slower when compared with an Ethernet cable. Using an Ethernet cable only allows internet access to the one device it is connected to, but in general, the internet speeds are much faster. I used speedtest.net to compare my Wi-Fi speeds with my Ethernet speeds. It should also be noted that my current plan is for 50 megabit per second download speeds and 25 megabit per second upload speeds. On Wi-Fi, I was getting about 13 megabit per second download speeds and 15 megabit per second upload speeds. Now, those aren't too shabby, but they are nowhere near the advertised speeds I should be getting. My Ethernet speeds were much more satisfying. I was getting around 58 megabit per second download speeds and 18 megabit per second upload speeds. The upload speeds still weren't quite where they should be, but the download speeds were actually faster than advertised. So which setup is best for you? Should you use Wi-Fi or Ethernet? Well, I personally would recommend Wi-Fi for the casual user who mainly spends their time just browsing the web and who values the ability to meander around while still being connected to the internet. I would recommend using an Ethernet cable for the more intensive internet users who spend their time streaming high definition content, downloading large files, and playing games on online servers. Alright, that wraps up this video. Hopefully I helped explain the differences between Wi-Fi and Ethernet. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.